Hello everyone and welcome to this week's video. Today I'm going to be explaining hybrid cars uh, and how hybrid cars work. So basically a hybrid car is just a car that uses two power sources in order to move itself. So the most common form uh, today is basically a gas uh, electric mix, but it could be something else. It could be, for example, diesel electric or it could be gas hydraulic or diesel and hydraulic. Uh, there, there's many ways you could have a hybrid car. Um, and in this example, I'm just going to be explaining two types of gas and electric uh, hybrid vehicle types. And the same principles could be ap applied to an electric and diesel, for example. So the two fundamental types of hybrids are a series hybrid and a parallel hybrid. So in a series hybrid, uh, everything basically is in series. So what we've got is we've got our fuel, which powers our engine. Our engine powers a generator, which generates power, which is then used to power the motor, which will drive the wheels, or to charge a battery. And the battery can also send its power to the motor to turn the wheels. So basically everything occurs in a straightforward, uh, simple series. The other type of hybrid car is parallel, and this means that both uh, power sources can directly power the wheels. So what you've got going on here is you've got a battery which charges the motor, the motor goes to the transmission, sends its power to the transmission, and then from the transmission you can send your power to the wheels. On the other side you've got fuel which powers your engine, and your engine also powers this transmission, and then that transmission sends the power to the wheels. So these, the motor and the engine are actually linked via the transmission. So they both send power to it, and then the power goes out to the wheels. So those are the two fundamental types of hybrid cars, and I'm going to have videos uh, in, in greater detail of each of them. Um, and also, there's in the description of this video, I've linked a bunch of uh, helpful links to my videos on, for example, batteries, uh, motors, um, other things like that, the generator, uh, which all play a part in how these hybrid cars work. So the big question is, why do hybrid, car hybrid cars get better fuel economy? Well, three main reasons, basically. Regenerative braking, so as you're slowing down, uh, you're, you're taking back some of that energy to use later. Um, so I've got a couple videos on that, which you can check out in the video description. Uh, also, using an electric motor plus a ICE engine, or internal combustion engine, uh, that allows for you to use a smaller engine, and so that smaller engine you can use uh, a more efficient engine and less fuel since you're going to use electric power, and electric motors are far more efficient than uh, internal combustion engines. Also, for example with this series, when you've got an engine powering a generator and it's not directly linked to the wheels, well that means you can spin that engine at any R RPM you want. So you can leave it at a set efficient speed um, rather than having it go through a rev range where there's inefficiencies, like in uh, standard uh, internal combustion engine powered cars. Uh, finally, there's the auto engine shutoff. So when you come to a stop, you can kill the engine, and to start accelerating, you can just use the power from the battery, send that to the motor, and then accelerate, then turn on your engine and regenerate power uh, and generate more power so that you can continue on to higher speeds. So those are the three big reasons for better fuel economy in hybrid cars. There's also other things that play into it, like aerodynamics, but obviously that can be easily applied uh, to any type of vehicle.